In this demo, we're going to talk about double key encryption. Microsoft recently released double key encryption around Microsoft Inspire conference. We are Golden 5 Consulting, an IT consulting company based in Los Angeles, USA. We are located in US, Canada, India. We are a Microsoft Gold Partner. We are a Tier 1 CSP. We are Authorized Education Partner and Microsoft Supplier. Double key encryption. The first thing comes in everyone's mind, what is double key encryption? Double key encryption provides two key encryption of your data, which is in Microsoft Cloud. One key remains with Microsoft and other key remains with you, which means that in any case, in any court order, in any judicial search or investigation, Microsoft cannot open a back door for requested data. It's locked by your key. Your data is more safer than ever. It also means that if you lose the key, Microsoft cannot help you in opening your data. So always, if something is very, very protected, you have kept in 10 locks, you have to keep the keys safe and reachable. If you cannot reach the key, your data can be in loss. However, I can see a lot of benefit where all the organizations, maybe public sector or criminal justice organizations or financial organizations who are not very comfortable in moving their data to Microsoft Cloud or any other cloud would be very happy to see this feature and probably move their data to Microsoft Cloud now. So real quick, let's see what are the requirements to deploy double key encryption. One. We have to create an Azure app service and configure the app. Number two, we have to configure security and compliant sensitivity labels and publish it. Once we do that, we have prepared our cloud to use double key encryption. Now we are left with three more steps which are required on the client machine side. Now with these steps look very simple. They're small software for Azure Information Protection Unified Client version 2.7.93 or above. Same thing for Office 65 Pro Plus Insider Build version 12711 or higher. And a couple of registry keys required as well. These you can deploy using Microsoft Intune, SCCM or whichever packaging software you have or group policies can configure a few things or even you can push everything from a batch file using group policies. However, everything is good with the testing. So always keep the testing in front, test with some couple of test users, test machines before you deploy to pub. Moving on, I would like to take you to the demo where I'm going to share how Golden 5 Consulting has configured the same configuration in our tenant. To do that, I'm taking you to our Windows Virtual Desktop environment. My team is using it and they're really happy to use it. Let's see. Here you go. It has saved my credentials. So it's not going to ask my credentials again. I'm using two, mo two monitors. So on my other monitor, it has started logging me in. As soon as I'm in, it will start showing up here my, as a second monitor. Here you go. So I'm next I'm going to log into Microsoft Azure portal to show you around how did we configure uh, double key encryption. So first thing first, portal.azure.com. Here you go. I have I had already logged in and you can see there's a DKE service here which I have configured. It's an app service which requires a little configuration. Next is looking into Azure Active Directory. Next, we have to register the app in Azure Active Directory. So this is the app you can see, DK Service app, and it has a couple of configurations where we also have to expose the API. So we, are, we have configured this already. Now moving on to the um, Security and uh, Compliance Center. This website will take you to the Security and Compliance Center where your sensitivity levels are already selected and I'm clicking um, labels so it can show up. I'm going to increase the window size 
and you can see we have already configured G5DKE level and I'm clicking on it will show you what do we see when we try to configure it. This was a new level and we when we apply the encryption I can see there's a uh, checkbox started coming where we can check it's a use double key encryption in the preview which is in the preview mode um, where you have to provide your app service URL and the applications name which you have created by the code once you do that finish this uh, by clicking on next multiple times and click done when it is done once you finish doing that you have to go to publish labels and add a labels publishing policy this is a policy which is going to push to every user which i have already done so i'm just going to show you what i did here i have already added i've already already added this policy i would like to add all of them so just not one it should have all of them this is what i'm creating a new policy however i'm going to go back and see publish levels here so i'm going to go to the label policies clicking on public policy which which is already configured so i'm going to click on edit policy click on edit policy and click next so I should get an option to check see now you can see the checkbox options are showing up all the checkboxes are checked so this policy is already configured on the configuration on the server side and the configuration side in the cloud this policy is already ready to use now I'm going to use a word file which I would like to configure or I can open a new word file and I identify that can be configured and you used for uh, this demo so I would like to mention that um, I would like to mention that at this point of time double key encryption is only uh, covering um, Microsoft Word Excel and PowerPoint labels are showing up here and I can select G5 DKE label and it has applied it um, for instance um, until I say but I in, until I save it it's not actually applied so I'm going to save it and I'm saving it in my OneDrive resume um, template well it's not that secure but again this is a demo for us so we don't want to even show any you know secret document which we don't want to uh, give in the back door um, so we're just uh, pretending this is a secret document now you can see the moment it saved the file and pushed it up this level um, uh, it has applied another yellow line to show you that this is the permissions available so this at this point of time double key encryption has been configured on this word document that ends the demo for any further questions, you can reach out to any of our numbers, US, Canada, India, or you can reach out to our sales email address. And we'll be happy to help you either deploying it, or if you have any other question, we'll be happy to help you with those questions. Or if you are in the US, we can assign you all Microsoft Cloud licenses as well, which are required for this, including Azure. We are also Microsoft Office 65, government approved, GCC approved, cloud solution provider so we can also help if you are a public organization talk to us thank you